Welcome to section four, where we're going to talk about dual candlestick patterns. And I really like dual candlestick patterns because they give us even more confirmation than a single candlestick pattern. So we're going to talk about four different types of dual candlestick patterns. The first two types of dual candlestick patterns are called engulfing patterns. There's the bullish engulfing and the bearish engulfing. The bullish engulfing pattern is a two candlestick pattern that signals a strong up move may be coming. It happens when a bearish candle is immediately followed by a larger bullish candle. Remember, bear equals sell, bull equals buy, so a bearish candle would be a candle moving down, and a bullish candle would be a candle moving up. So basically what happens, as you can see here with bullish engulfing, is the second candle engulfs the bearish candle. This means buyers are starting to take control and there may be a strong up move after a recent downtrend or a period of consolidation. The bearish engulfing pattern is just the opposite of the bullish pattern. This type of candlestick pattern occurs when the bullish candle is immediately followed by a bearish candle that completely engulfs it. This means that sellers overpowered the buyers and that a strong down move could happen. The second two dual candlestick patterns are called tweezer bottoms and tweezer tops. This type of candlestick pattern usually occurs after an extended uptrend or downtrend, indicating that a reversal will soon occur. You can see the candlestick formation looks just like a pair of tweezers. The first candlestick is the same as the overall trend. So for example, with tweezer bottoms, you can see it's trending down. These black candles that are bearish candles are trending down. And so the first one is also a bearish candle that is also trending down. Whereas with tweezer tops, you can see it's trending up. We have a lot of bullish candles and the first one is a bullish candle that's also moving up. The second candlestick is opposite the overall trend. So with tweezer bottoms, when the price is moving down, the second candlestick would be bullish or moving up. Whereas with tweezer bottoms, since the overall trend is up, then the second candlestick should be bearish or moving down. Another important thing is the shadows of the candlestick should be of equal length. Tweezer tops should have the same highs, while tweezer bottoms should have the same lows. And that's it. Pretty simple, huh? So these are the four dual candlestick patterns that you can look out for to identify a reversal in a trend, whether it's an uptrend or a downtrend. Now in the next section, we're going to talk about triple candlestick patterns to go ahead and finish up the candlestick pattern section of this module. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Make sure you join our free Discord channel to get access to all the cheat sheets and a bunch of other cool bonuses. The next video in the course is right here.